What is going on Warriors? It's your boy Shinryu back again with another video and today we're going to be doing something um, th interesting and we're going to be talking about uh, certain actions that I have actually been experimenting on on my free play account which I would definitely desist you guys from actually doing okay. So I'm doing something that's a little bit crazy right now where when it comes to my resources when it comes to actually trying to go for certain things and all that kind of stuff and that is sort of like hindering my progress right now in the game now i know you guys are looking at me saying hey what do you mean slow down on the game you're currently on four uh, on 34 right now and yeah but the truth of the matter is that I could have been for it, uh, further forward and um, one of the ways I can actually prove this is because uh, like I, I typically try to mention my brother because we almost start about the same time I actually had maybe like about a three weeks or two weeks head two weeks head start uh, on him or uh, uh, was it a week plus or two weeks at most head start on him but he's currently on um, 31 I believe he's 20 something right now or even further I know he's about to get it there 140 but here's what I'm trying to talk about right now, okay? There are certain core principles that you actually have to be able to perform that you must have performed in order to actually progress. And we're gonna go over to my character selection right now. The number one thing is this, okay? The moment you actually unlock Divination, you have to go all out on Bison until you get to the minimum uh, SS Plus, which would typically unlock his FS moves. As, but I would typically recommend triple S because when you want to go further you want to make sure that you unlock the cars where you can actually start to fix them and actually get the two stars as much as you can okay that is the first thing you want to do and typically while you're building up your character in that mode right you're gonna be getting certain triple S vehicle kits that you can obviously customize to the character of your choice in most cases you want to make it bison and all that stuff because bison is typically it seems like his viability is going to be infinite okay the way he actually works his blast and everything they actually work great and they actually help you out on the defensive end okay it's like almost like an automatic parry in that when he gets attacked you're still going to get rewarded with damage points because he's going to blast and then it's going to obviously reduce the character's lives typically in large proportions okay the next thing obviously you want to do is you want to make sure that you are actually building your primary unit as quickly as possible meaning you're going through you know our routes like if we're going to go over here again oh no let's go to draw rather uh, you want to go through routes like choice recruits to try and fast track the characters you are pretty much interested in getting except if they're typically you know um master or inferno characters and uh, typically when they're master inferno characters you only want to be going for at this point in time it is not even like up for debate anymore you don't want to be going for master inferno characters in divination okay you don't want to be bothering and wasting resources on the rest of these characters in my own opinion they should not even be present at all like it should not even be an option because it's almost like you tempt you to waste resources because it's obviously going to be not because they're not good enough no but because it is obviously going to be a smarter uh choice to use gems in the choice recruit or try to like go ahead with a faction unless you're sort of like so impatient that you once you exhaust the choice recruit options you would typically want to now go divination to keep piling up that is totally the wrong way to go about it that is the one action i'm never going to do so you guys are probably still wondering what the wrong stuffs are okay so let's go to the wrongs that i'm doing right now what not wrong stuff i would say crazy because for me um totally um invested in that crazy move that i'm doing and it all boils down to one character again and it's pretty much because of this guy evil ryu all right so all right yeah what's 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 uh the big deal uh evil ryu and kind of stuff what you know you only have the option of using you know special summons to actually you know uh get the character but i am doing something crazy i'm sure you guys have already noticed right now I still have a total of 44,154 gems and that is because I am not using it for other things like divination okay what I was doing previously was I was only using divination scrolls to actually pull for the character right but then I saw like 
but I wasn't and I wasn't using gems. So, but all of a sudden, I've actually even stopped that as well. What I'm doing is I'm dedicating every single energy resource I can to maxing out my every as quickly as possible because being free to play means you don't have that luxury that pay to play players have and you either have to choose to sacrifice and not do any other things with your resources as you gather them or you go right ahead and try and spread the love build other characters but as you get your special summons going once you get every triple s and can now go all out either with divinations or gems okay now okay you might think that's actually not bad you know okay fine you know uh 40k is not really much in terms of all that kind of stuff but guess what is happening here again my divination scrolls i'm not even using them anymore they're all being stacked up for prioritizing every year you guys know how i actually pull i don't pull crazy in that i keep going bam 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 what i typically do is i pull to like get a character and then i pause so it's not even going to be like a bam bam instant pull the only thing that is going to be is this it is going to be as often as i can when i feel like i've actually dedicated a decent amount towards the gameplay of the game but otherwise yeah this is actually been part of that as well by now you guys are thinking this is supposed to be dedicated for bison because guess what like i told you guys before my bison is suffering as a result of this all right my bison is still on s plus that is abominable guys you don't want to try this if you want to progress in the game take this from me okay i've actually been so many times you wonder why i've done this thank god thank god for the lending system as you guys can see right now look at how many bison I have as mercenaries most people don't even bother with loaning bison anymore because they know that's their first priority characters they're going to get them up as high as possible and eventually trying to loan for a bison becomes almost obsolete for them unless they're pretty much new players now what else is crazy stuff i'm doing here okay it's, it's just a bunch of like not stuff i'm doing right now right look at my gems okay you guys remember this regular chest of gems i'm just stacking them up like i'm not even touching them at all i'm not even unleashing them at all you know i'm not trying to get extras i totally have it i have a total of 453 right now of the common gems these are 10 each so i have you know about 4.5k at the bare minimum in terms of like you know gems to actually like pull out of nowhere that is you know another divination close to you know like that's like you know almost close 5,000 already it was 500 more and i'm already there right but that doesn't end there i have the 30s as well the 30s i don't have as much they're pretty much on 390 so that pretty much amounts to just a little over i believe um you know 1k or so right it's not super much you know in that regard but then check this one out okay the ones that are like a hundred right i have like oh uh, there is a hundred let's get the ones that are a hundred per one i have 127 in them that is like about 12.7 k gems already that is and and all these gems are pretty much all being choked out right now for evil you I feel like right now that is the only guy that I feel like I'm super invested in trying to get in that. When I don't get him during pools, it's gonna hurt. I feel like once I get him out of the way, almost every other person I'm just gonna be like, no, we're just gonna be going through the motions. Can we pull? Great, can we not pull? And it's gonna be more or less a relaxing sort of pull until another version of Ryu comes out, okay? And I think that's gonna be a while yeah so that's pretty much what i'm doing right now of course the other thing i'm doing which is crazy it's not super crazy is i'm actually most people what the strategy has been is that because it's too expensive they only buy the first purchase which is about what 800 i believe yeah but i'm just i'm just maxing everything out all my gems are just going all my you know yeah gems i think is it gems i used to go for this yeah gems all my gems are going towards this guy and i'm just going and going and going and also but that is the reason why i haven't touched my other gems and all that kind of stuff right so those that is the crazy stuff that i've actually been doing right now with regards to my account or uh, where i've sort of like put everything on on you know every you and because it's because he's sort of like been very viable you just have to be able to uh, be patient enough if you're not patient to use the interrupt you know moves he's typically the next thing you want to do and if you want to use you know zangief as interrupt typically you want to put him on in a bare minimum triple s no stars in order to be viable with that 
but with him it's been pretty great uh, and and also another thing I do is this with regards to these idol gems I don't usually pick them up until I see what I consider the gold standards when it comes to what you expect from the idol rewards okay the easiest way I can actually describe the gold standards is pretty much the final bits of things is when you want to go to something like for example the reward preview index and chain right these ones are tend to be one percent that you know once you get them you know you're actually going to do good stuff like the definition scrolls the faction coins i think that's pretty much about those two those are what you consider that in this particular pool everything that you pull from here is pretty much like eh if you don't pull the right things right because they're just there right that's why they have high probabilities so over here right now with this idle rewards the gold standards will be things like having an s kit right the red ones that is also having you know one of the ex you know i don't count this ones no one of the ex you know move shards you have one of those as well that pretty much counts for those as well uh, and then i believe the last thing is the t1s or the t2s those are extremely rare i don't think i've gotten any t2 I think I've gotten T11 something like that but but those are the ones that are like the absolute ones right if you get any of those if I get any of those ones uh, out from this idle rewards then I would typically claim it if I wait and I don't see anything here I don't care if I wait for like you know 10 hours unless it tells me I can't wait anymore or unless I mistakenly click out of place I don't typically collect I just leave it there I let them pile up as the way it is meaning I give it less chance to refresh because typically sometimes even in one hour you can actually get one of those special rewards but those are just pretty much some of the crazy you know things that I've sort of been doing with my account okay um Shadaloo I've sort of like held off a bit um I want to see if I can get to 30 20 that's what I've been doing for a bit and whenever I realize I haven't been I'm not close I just try to rush it as much as I can with my top units in the game here and as I mentioned before because of my full dedication to every right now this is what that has resorted to okay every is obviously the first priority and as you can see it's only barely just an S plus we still have a long way to go so many I'm still gonna be hoarding those resources unfortunately um, next guy is Ryu and because of that I didn't even show you the final stuff apologies guys the final stuff I want to show you guys was the triple s vehicle kit this is all for one person you guys can already guess it this one i was a bit confused with this i'm gonna have to start spreading this love across to whoever the next best things are that are currently available not that i'm actually hoping to like you know develop and from then on you know it should be smooth selling from then once i obviously get that picked up so that's pretty much the last bit of it here oh I have 500 so does that mean I can actually pull I just hold on here I'm actually no I don't I just have 100 of this oh it means I can actually purchase a character oh yeah I'm gonna go for you no know, trendy cami I was a bit conflicted but I'm just gonna keep on depending on jury from there and then whatever stuff I have left oh I didn't even look at this uh, but I you know what I'm gonna still depend on the regular whatever if I wanted it to be deep I would have gone for you know like uh what you call like the you know um character pool the you know what they call that I'm just gonna just go right here so I can remember the name uh go draw it, um choice recruit yeah that's what I was talking about here all right so that's pretty much all I've been doing has been sort of like crazy where I've been hoarding you know um units I typically hoard this one you guys already know about this I've done a few pulls on this I'm trying to hoard a bit further as well uh, right now if I try to use this I can only pull about 18 characters that's not much compared to the fact that you could actually do that in the past before so uh, we're gonna pretty much um, wrap the video up here that's all I wanted to share about what I've been doing with my account that's sort of been nuts uh, I'm also hoarding this because I'm gonna do like a four pull for the EX moves if that doesn't work that doesn't work and if I don't just get one it's gonna be painful that's honestly that's gonna hurt but hopefully that's not the case okay because pulling four I think I'm due for one EX move to pull from a five for me multi all right so that's pretty much it from me guys I uh, just wanted to show you what I've been doing with my uh, free play account or uh, the progress I've made with you know um, every year as well um, and all that good stuff otherwise 
that's pretty much it from me from you i appreciate your watch i appreciate your view i would appreciate a like obviously and of course the subscribe is always going to be dear to my heart help me make the channel grow for sure and i'll catch you guys on the next one cheers guys